In Office 365, sometimes it becomes useful to have full access to another person's mailbox. That person uh, may be about to be terminated. You may need to see what's in their mailbox, may need to offload it, that kind of thing. Or maybe you just have an assistant to an executive who needs to have someone have access to their mailbox as well. So let's go ahead and click on admin and we'll set that up. Let's click on edit a user in the admin center and a new box pops up and we're going to click on Jane Doe. And from here we're going to go over to the mail settings area. Let's scroll down and let's click where it says mailbox permissions and edit. So we have several options here. The first one is read and manage. That's full access to the mailbox. So that's the one we want. Let's go ahead and click edit and we're going to add permissions and we're going to add my account and click save and now we'll click close and close again and close again and the X at the top now let's go ahead and switch over to our mailbox and we'll go ahead and open Jane Doe's email from my email so I'm logged in now to my Outlook web access and I'll click on my name at the top and click on open another mailbox and we'll go ahead and just type in Jane and it found Jane and we'll click open and sometimes you get a, an error the first time you do it if you try to do it too quickly but uh, I went ahead and refreshed and the second time it worked it took about five minutes for it to refresh before it started working and now we can see I'm both in my mailbox here to the left and I'm in Jane's mailbox here to the right. So I can go ahead and view everything that's in Jane's mailbox as well as send and receive email as well. So that's how you give a user full permissions in Office 365.